Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, Ooh. and this is episode 10 of my <laughs> Alpha 20. Seven days to die. Let's play. Uh, we're back. It's night time, and we've got to get to work. Uh, I'm going to try and Ooh. illuminate the area a little bit, but actually, let's. Oh, nuts. Uh, let's bring our torch back. We're gonna have to illuminate this area so we can see because I haven't gotten a helmet light mod, helmet light mod schematic, or anything <laughs> to do with that. So in order to make a torch we're gonna need some cloth and some animal fat. We don't have like a lot of animal fat so let's say uh I guess four torches torches yeah make those we can set them up around the outside oh my god yeah look at this it's so dark and I guess, uh, until we find, like, a helmet light, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and turn our brightness up to, like, 75. Bye. Yeah, that should help a little bit. Oh, that does actually help a lot. Um, just because we're gonna be working in the dark a lot. So we'll put these torches, uh, like, should it be in the middle or in the corner? Put it in the middle. Now we, we got, get out of here, grass. Uh oh, gotta wait for the last one. There we go. Awesome. All right, let us check out our brand spanking new shovel. Oh, two hits. That as well. I'm sure putting the points in minor 69 or didn't hurt either. And the light and the brightness is helping a lot. So this is good. This is good. These are looking up. These are looking up. Um, I'm hoping to get uh, the French dug all the way around. Um, that would be nice. <laughs> At least three deep. Um, I definitely want it deeper than that, but I would definitely like it three down. Maybe even four if I can, but we'll. We'll do three uh, to start and try to get that all the way around and put spikes in it. And then I guess as uh, time goes on, uh, we can deepen the trench and build our cage on the inside. I don't know that I'll be able to dig out the inside before the board comes. I don't know how I'm going to do this, uh, honestly. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to work. I didn't, I didn't think this all the way through, I don't guess. Okay, uh... That's only two, I think. Me too. Let's get a little ramp. So we need to go down one more. Oh, the shovel is fantastic. I love it. It's gonna help so, so much. 
I'm really sad that I gotta get rid of those videos, but I couldn't hear. I could barely hear my voice, and uh, I had I built my new computer. I hooked my microphone up, my same exact microphone from my old setup, and I hooked it up to my new computer, and it wouldn't work. Uh, so my daughter had got me a new microphone for uh, Christmas. So I put that on there, and I thought I got it to work, and I set everything up right, but it reverted back. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but it lost all the settings, and I couldn't figure out how to get it to work again. So, okay, this is only too wide, uh, and I want it three wide so a three deep three wide i don't know why it just sounds like a good number to me three is the best number there we go oh yeah uh -oh. So I, I've been trying other survival games, and boy, let me tell you, it sure is hard to play other survival games after you've played Seven Days to Die, because you're like, um, why am I playing this? Why am I not just playing Seven Days to Die? Because Seven Days to Die gets me everything I want. <laughs> so yeah, it's really hard. Uh, I have a lot of hours spent in seven days to come. I have over 3,000 hours. Uh, yeah. Uh, but I have tried other, other survival games. Um, I don't know. It's just, it's really hard to not play seven days to die. <laughs> they just, um, they hit, they hit the nail on the head, you know? Uh, good job, guys. And so, but I still try uh, every now and then to, to play a different survival game. And there's another one in, uh, what do they call that? Uh, Hate the grass on the edge. It just it annoys me. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'm at a loss for words right now. I don't know why. I can't think of the name of the word I'm looking for, and so I'm, my brain just stopped functioning. Um. Well, we got one side, three down, three wide. Um, so we got one, two, three. Boom, boom, boom. Get the little corner over here. Oh, yeah. Uh, putting the brightness up helped a lot. We need to rest a little bit. We oh we we could get something to drink. We got some more uh, tea in here. So go ahead and drink that up. This uh, some more of our buff. And I think I want to. Go ahead and make some more tea. There we go. Get that going. Get some blood water. Minute and 30 seconds. 
And we'll come back in a minute and we'll put uh, the next thing in. Yeah, we got lots of stamina. Two, uh oh, and a three. Ah, oh, I hate it when I get the grass instead of the dirt. So the plan is to have these all be like, this whole trench is like covered in um, cement. Yes. Um, and we can put like tons of obstacles and traps in their way to the trench so that they're even taking damage as they approach us. So they're not at full health. Which would be nice. Uh, so that's like the whole plan. And I might even uh you know make a maze underground for them to go in and get lost instead of finding me. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Um, maybe if if we can lure them away from my cage uh, with fake doors, uh, maybe that would work. I don't know. We'll have to see for sure. Uh, see what works. Oh. Dude, hungry again. Ah, I don't even my chest. We don't have. Oh, you know what we could do? We could take this other eleven water, some of this cornmeal, make some cornbread. Gonna make our red tea. Watch just the red tea. Three minutes. Okay. Then we'll do the oil, all of the old water, and then. Um, my only concern is getting out of this thing. What if I get stuck in there? How am I going to get out? I don't know. We're gonna have to figure something out. Um, we could um, right back here or something. Just come out of ways and. Maybe make an entrance here that would go underground and come up. Uh, but we have to go further down than our trench. So we have to go quite a, quite a ways down. But I don't know that I want to start that just yet. I definitely want to get a trench entrenched. <laughs> um, so there we go.
Okay. Sorry about that. Boy, I just got digging and... <laughs> My mind just wandered away. Um, so yeah. Getting the trench dug out. Um... I have to think of... I mean, there's not really any way to make this exciting. Well, I guess we could get a couple of zombies coming in packets or something throughout the night. Oh, dude, it's up day six. Oh my goodness. This is gonna be a scramble. We're gonna have to use like, uh, most of our wood to build uh, the walls. And then, um, we're not going to have enough for, for uh, wraps. Okay, that's only two down. Oh, man, look at how much damage. Oh, it's four o'clock already. It's, we just got started. Uh-oh. I hear him. Oh, there. Oh my god, it's a wandering horde. Oh. Nobody gets into my. Whoa. I forgot. Take 80 stamina. Don't run before. Don't run to them. Let them run to you. Oh, gotcha! Gotcha! Well, it sure will be nice to get 30 stamina back for a kill. For sure. Oh, I'm getting really good at this. Oh, those points are helping so much. Uh, let's go ahead and whack out this rock. It's daytime now. Uh, we can actually see, so that's good. It's real good. It gives us a uh, little bit of time. I thought I would have gotten a lot more done. Oh my goodness. Um, we're gonna we're gonna get clobbered. We're gonna get clobbered. Uh, I don't have the cage built. I don't even have uh, wood on the outside. But I don't really. I do want to have like these corners for sure to be solid blocks. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. I don't know how I want it. Because I've never had it this way before. Uh, we'll see what, what, how we can make it work. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm not sure about... I mean, there are some boring stuff that I'm gonna have to like uh, leave in the way I'm recording where I'm just recording the day and I'm recording the night or should I just record during the day since the night time is so dark and then I could do uh, all the boring stuff at night oh oh let's go see about getting that food like, oh, got to put more wood in there. You can get new cornbread. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and do that, and then we'll go back to the water. So we can get. Oh, actually, let's make more cornbread. What? 
Get a little bit of food in our tumblums. Yeah, that's not bad. That's ten food. Uh, we do lose water, but that's okay. That's it's as much food as a piece of meat. So heck yeah, that was a good find. Uh, that up, and we'll we have plenty of drink. So. If it is only 10, the meat only gets 10 if we have to boil it. Um, I guess there's no real reason to do boiled meat unless you need the health. Um, you could just do grilled meat or then charred meat, because I think charred meat gives you 10. Um, eat that one too. Oh no! I keep running out of fuel. Okay, so. Let us look. Do we have. I think we have enough stuff to where we could make. And that might help us increase our productivity even more. We're going to have to make a uh, duct tape. And then an axe. And we want iron pickaxe. And we're going to need the iron. Didn't I get my iron out? I did get my iron out. Why can't I make it? Oh, because I didn't have the duct tape yet. There we go. We used up a lot of our iron, but this should help us. Let's see. Look at all the clay we have. Oh my goodness. I have been so clay deficient on all the little games I've started uh, in this. Uh, and while wow, this. Okay, it's done. Let's go ahead and get some more cornbread going. Two minutes and 38 seconds. Uh, there we go. That should all be there. Let's go see if we can find some water. Oh no, I'm stuck. There we go. Um, we haven't really explored anywhere. Oh, look, I have it. Um, is that a four? <clears throat> no! It's a wolf! Yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> We've got <a> meat! <laughs> We're gonna survive another day! Oh yeah, we got some fat too. Um, I'm hoping that maybe over in this way there's some type of culvert nearby that has some water in it. Uh oh. This is a farm. I don't know if there's going to be a culvert near a farm. Oh! Oh, an egg! Not an egg! Yeah, I get like a little hiccup every now and then, but the game seems to be running so good on my new computer. Uh oh. Don't run up to them. Let them come to you. <laughs> I keep forgetting. 
I get so excited. I just want to smash some zombies. Okay, no water in this culvert. Can we see anything on the map? No. Uh -oh. I see a chicken over there in the farm, but I don't know how I can get over there. <laughs> uh, here's some more culverts. Really need some water. Down to our last ten drinks and we need more stuff. Anything on the map yet? Look at this road. Now this is one of the things that they've added. Get roads with actual stripes down them. Oh my goodness. I'm being <laughs> docked. <laughs> you get street corners with signs on them, <laughs> traffic lights. I mean, come on. This is just really cool. <laughs> is it not? Look at that. Uh, to me, that's beautiful. That is beautiful. Um, really, I really think they did a fantastic job. It just keeps it better. Um, okay, I am not seeing any water this way. Oh, uh oh, oh, that is a zombie dog. Uh oh. He sees me. Ah! Yeah, I didn't mean to shoot you, buddy, but... Ah! No! I'm bleeding! Where did you come from? What? Jiminy Christmas! Look at that building up there. Now, I have to be honest. Uh, while that building is pretty impressive, I have no desire to go in there. <laughs> Honestly, anything that would take me in there is going to take hours. And yeah, I mean, I guess you could do it in stages, uh, but you pretty much, uh, that's, oh man, the zombies, <laughs> you would think it's a zombie apocalypse or something, um, any water, oh, look, I think there's some up here on the right, I think there's, uh, water filtration system or something over here. Oh, it's, it's in a bunk. Oh, look at that. It's filled out. Oh, this is so awesome. Look at the park. It's got some little trees in the evening, right? Would you be quiet? It's so good. Look at this place. There's an old church, a bridge. Oh, look, that zombie's coming to eat me. It's gonna jump off the bridge. Just oh. oh. where is he? Oh, I must have woken them up under there. Jump. Oh, sucks to be you. Don't run, don't run. All right, we got our water. Let's skedaddle. Oh, hey. 
sneaking up on me. All right. Um, I have to check these mailboxes. They could have books in them. Um, yeah. Oh, dude, I made the wrong one. I made a pickaxe instead of an axe. How? Oh, that is so disappointing. Because I don't have enough iron to make another one. I'm not going to get something that that got more exploding arrows and crossbow bolts. Oh, look at the town. It's just crazy. I can't believe I did that. I can't believe I did that. I made a pickaxe. Oh well, it's better than what we got. Gotta get some more dinner. We're not gonna make it. We don't eat. Okay, and we gotta- oh man! We gotta get back, it's almost 10 o'clock already. Holy shizoli. This is crazy. Um, I'm running out of time. I'm not used to playing on 60 minute days. Uh, <laughs> this is gonna be a bad, a bad fortnight. <laughs> I usually start building my base on day one and then I have, uh, you know, plenty of stuff built. Alright, let's get... We gotta go pretty far to get some water, though. I don't really like that. Don't really like that at all. I didn't think I would have to go uh, that far. I would have brought my bicycle. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> gonna go around the corner or something but got all the way out here I have to run back uh, but hey we did get the uh, the cool park um, that looked amazing there was a bridge in the city uh, with zombies living underneath it it's the troll bridge We'll be able to get a bacon and eggs. And we got uh, we got some more meat, so that is good. I think we just really needed to get away from the base to go go and get some food and drink. So we could survive. Oh no eggs. There's the traitor. Ah, oh, we're almost there. All right. So we're gonna try. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get this done. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to get inside of it or out, in or out very easily. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.